Hi, everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to make this amazing 3D rainbow in Adobe Illustrator. This also includes making a vector of the rainbow first, and then converting it into a 3D image. To start off, we are first going to create a circle by pressing down Shift and the Alt keys together. Then we will go to Object, Path and Offset Path. And we are going to set the offset path as minus 100 pixels. Then we are going to eye drop this yellow color. And now we are going to repeat the same steps for the rest of the colors. The offset path number will remain the same for all. I will paste the hex code of all the colors in the description below in case you might want to use them. And now we are done with all of the colors of the rainbow that we are going to use. Let me just resize this rainbow to its correct size so it doesn't look a bit too long or short. Now press Ctrl Y to open the wireframe in Adobe Illustrator. Take the direct selection tool and select the bottom half of the rainbow. After you are done with that just delete it. Now to make them all separate shapes I'm going to use the Shape Builder tool to do so. Select the yellow part of the rainbow and copy it. Then using the Shape Builder tool press Alt and click on the yellow color. After you are done with that just press Ctrl F. And now we can do the same for the rest of the colors. Please do subscribe our channel if you find this video helpful and give it a thumbs up below. Seems like we are almost done with this part. This part is very important as in the end it gives some 3D look to the rainbow along with the shadows. Now it is time to make the clouds. To make the clouds, just take a bunch of circles and combine them together. Then using the Pathfinder tool, click on Unite to combine them into one shape. We can then use the eyedropper tool to eyedrop this grayish color. We can also copy the same cloud and paste it as another one. This process may take some time as it is an intricate design. Unite You might also want to resize the cloud. Now select everything and group it together. Then go over to Window and open the 3D and Materials tab. Select the rainbow and click on Inflate in the Object tab. It will take some time depending on your computer's memory. It may even not respond or close the app but it's worth it. 
Now come over to Materials and go over to Properties. Set the Roughness to 0.63 and Metallic to 0.2. After you are done with that, come over to the Lightings tab and Presets. Set the intensity to 97%, rotation to 90 degrees, height to 48 and softness to 90. If you want you can change the color of the light as you can see I did over here. But anyways it might ruin your original look. So best to not touch the color panel. And there you go an amazing 2D rainbow vector converted into a 3D image.